Well, I'm really sorry I can't be with you today at this really important event. I have to say I hadn't saved the date in my diary because I wasn't holding my breath to win a Spectator Award. You see, after the Labour Party conference, I read what Fraser Nelson had written about my Labour Party speech. And he said this, that it was about a very dangerous principle dug out of its 1970s grave and held up for applause at the Labour Party conference. So imagine my surprise when I got this. Fraser, thank you very much. I'm so delighted with this award. Let me also say that the other reason I can't be with you is I'm engaged in a very, very important battle with a leading vested interest from the media. And you know I quite like taking on those battles. Who's my battle with? It's with the Sunday Sport because they published something quite scurrilous about my dad. It said this, Ed Miliband's dad killed my kitten. And frankly, you couldn't make this stuff up. It's about a lady called Eunice and her cat called Winston. And this is what she said. Winston was my only friend. One night he was late coming home, so I went out to look for him. It was a freezing, foggy night. I shouted, come here, Winston. But at that moment, a young naval officer came pedalling down the road on his bike, singing in a language I now know to be Belgian. He was obviously steaming drunk. He barreled into Winston, squishing him flat, then carried on as though nothing had happened. I'm convinced that man was Ralph Miliband. Only a Belgian, a Belgian communist, could have killed a kitten in cold blood like that, the red bastard. Now that is what I'm up against, friends. So I'm sorry I can't be with you. Thank you to The Spectator for the award. Uh, and I look forward to seeing you on the campaign trail. Thank you very much.